What is up guys, welcome back, it is day 18, uh, sorry for the short break, uh, sort of goes back to what I was saying before, it was such a turbulent time and sort of not much was happening at, at the same time, it was like there's no point making a video, let me sort of digest what's happened over the last two days, then I'll make a video, so, sad it's finally digested, I thought I might just regurgitate onto you all a bit of a thought, and hopefully not the imagery, um, yeah, I've, um, uh, comes back to the whole testosterone increasing thing that sort of you sort of look at your life and you sort of recently I've realized how much I've been taken advantage of just in general um, not so much specifically from person to person although it can get specific but also from just culture in general from an energetic level how you, you just feel like so much of your energy has just been taken away and siphoned away by things that really don't deserve all the time attention and love that you can give and a lot of that is actually willing, so you'll sort of have this like co-relationship whereby you'll willingly give energy to something or, or some project or some person and uh, instead of actually owning it for yourself and uh, it, all, it all sort of goes back to what I was saying to my previous video, it's like what will you do when you actually get to day 90 and you have all this, all this power at your disposal. I mean, yeah, power is a large word, but that's how I look at it. It is power. It's re it's responsibility. It's it's energy. When you have all this energy to use, what will you do with it? And I think a lot of people they they don't know how to actually deal with it because they're so used to giving it away or taking things that will deplete it, consciously or not. That the moment you actually get there, it's like, well, what do I do now? And recently, I've just been realizing how much of my own energy has just been sapped and drained away from me, um, and how much of that was was my own choice and how much of that was an unconscious choice because most of the time if not all of the time it's your choice where your energy goes where your energy flows um, but anyway it, it, this sort of goes down into just like my job um, why am I giving myself and my time and my energy to people that have questionable ethics and quite frankly I don't really like them um, why do I give my time and my energy to um, just society in general why do I uh, you know, it's, it's 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 a very very vague term, and I'm still sort of trying to sort of digest it, and uh, you know, sort of like feeding into the trolls. Like, you know that something winds you up, but you do it anyway. You will, you know that you can get yourself into a better position, but instead you choose to feed and funnel the 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 bad things. Like, you'll you'll choose to do something bad, even though you know it's bad for you. So why why is it that you choose to do that? What will you do with that energy? But it's it's just been very very hard for me to really de de decode that and try and understand. And uh, I think this comes on the on the on the coattails of just when you start to you know, when your energy levels start to stabilize. Now you just sort of think, wow, like so that's where it's all gone. <laughs> like, what am I doing with it? Why is it over there? It shouldn't be over there. What are you doing? Get off of that. It's fine. Um, yeah, and it's um, I, I I I wish I could be more 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 verbally explanatory. More verbally explanatory. Yeah, there we go. That will make it have more sense. Uh, I, I wish I could explain more, but that's really what it's what I've just been thinking about recently, and um, how to just like take charge of it and really channel it into doing other things and taking responsibility for it, which is one of the big things because you know a lot of a lot of the time, especially with a lot of our addictions and when, whenever we do something that we know we shouldn't do, it's usually because we don't want to take responsibility for the consequences of that. Um, like for example, we'll smoke even though we shouldn't do because we don't want to take responsibility of A, getting better and we push away and ignore the responsibility of what happens when you're sick, what happens when it makes you ill. No, oh, I didn't have to deal with that. Of course you're going to have to deal with that. And so it's, you know, trying to figure out what the hell I'm going to do with it. Anyway, this is, uh, that's all I really wanted to say. Uh, other than that, I, I actually feel a lot more manly and the reason why I say that, it's not just NoFab, it's iodine. Iodine. If you're on, a, on any sort of an iodine thing, like even my voice has gone down, I feel more driven to do things, get on iodine, even if it's one drop of blue goals, 7-15%, you'll feel the difference, man. I mean, iodine is absolutely crucial for people, especially men. Um, uh, but yeah, uh, so that's all I've got to say for today. It's still going, day 18. Um, I'll be back to posting regularly for my NoFap. I'm going to give myself a week of just making sure that I post something every day, because there, de there are times when I want to post something, but... Like, either I'm too busy or I'll just be like, oh, I'll, I'll do it later. I was just going to hold my balls to the wall and say, look, you know, day 19, post, post. Anyway, that's all. Peace out.